right, let me show them. Hey everybody, it's Elon Bomani, and like I promised you, we decided to do the Pajama Mama show today in Miami. It is cold in ATL. I left there with rain, dark clouds, hail, sleet, snow. Okay, I'm exaggerating a little bit. It's not like that at all, but we decided, you know, that's the beautiful thing about being the Pajama Mama and the Kippeneurs, that this money and this opportunity gives us choices. So we decided to do the show and do our life. In Miami, but remember, I always tell you the first business is the family business. I think we've earned it. We worked hard. I always say, work hard, play hard. They were a song about one. Here it here it goes. <laughs> so we're gonna play a little bit today and enjoy the palm trees. We saw people coming from New York. We saw people coming from Ohio, Quebec, Canada, and Mercedes and Maseratis and Rolls Royces and just chilling, just coming down here. Everybody got a smile on their face. Don't let anybody tell you that wealthy people ain't happy. <laughs> and you can hear the hustle. You can hear the bustle, you know, about what's going on. Look at these wonderful sky-rise buildings. I was sharing with my kids these small little hole in the wall homes were going for millions of dollars, and they couldn't understand that. But location, location, location. Show, show them the houses on the, on the water river. That's what it's truly all about, you know. And, and that's what I do. I always have to change my environment and be uh, constantly around wealth and abundance. And what does that do? It's addictive, it's contagious, and it makes you sit there and dream big and get more ideas that will bring more abundance into your life and, and living. And we're on our way to our fabulous Hyatt Hotel. We're gonna be staying there. It's gonna be on the beach, on the water. We're gonna go kick up some sand and have a great time. But the main message that I wanted to share with you today and talk to you today about is that make sure that you do the things that you need to do in order to make sure that you spend that quality time with your family. The reason why, oh, look at that. Oh, my God, that BMW. I wanted that. Look at that BMW. That's nice. I wanted one of the little spinsters. My grandmother used to call them a cheap man's car because they only had two, two car seats. Nobody else could get in the car with the person. <laughs> love my grandmother. Rest in peace, grandma. All oh, my palm trees. I miss my California palm trees. That's the thing I loved about California, being around sunshine, fresh air. And having the choice to do with your time what you want to do with it, ladies and gentlemen. But the main reason why I'm out here is because guess what? It's time for me to be a mama. Not the, just the pajama mama making money in my PJs, but it's time for me to spend some quality time with my kids. You know, to get in the sand and, you know, build a sand castle and kick up, you know, some of that water and see the smile on their face and let them enjoy the moments of the fruits of their labor, their hard work that, you know, you always make sure you have as much fun as you make as much money. And so that's what we're going to do. So far, they had an $80 lunch, <laughs> a vegan lunch to get the party started. Now we're going to go out here, like I said, enjoy some beach, some sunshine, some fresh air. Uh, got some smiles on the face. We're going to pick up a Miami uh, dolphin uh, uh, a hat or a flag or something. My youngest son, he loves the Miami dolphins. I don't know. This is the first time we've ever been to Miami. I've never been to Miami in 15 years that I've been on this earth. So we had to come down there and make some noise and have a good time. But that's what we think about why you're doing what you're doing to become a pajama mama or a dadpreneur. This is why we do all the things that we do. We want to show you, to show them, oh, look at that. Ah, yes, and we're dreaming about our future. Maybe we'll come down and we'll buy one of these houses on the water <laughs> and chill during our retirement phase. But uh, with that said, ladies and gentlemen, that's why I am here. You always got to have some personal R&R, &R, rest and relaxation. And like I said, sit back and meditate and, and pray and get back out there and start creating some more abundance to have, have it shift and have it to continue to grow and continue to prosper in order to do the things that you want to do. But I wanted to show you the beautiful thing about these things. Money only gives you, millions of dollars only give you greater choices to do the things with your life that you want to do. I mean, like, you know, hey, it's rainy, it's sunny, it's cloudy, a storm is coming. Hey, take a plane ride. You've heard it where people, you know, get on a plane ride and say they want to have lunch in France <laughs> or a patty. And so they get the plane ride and they're going out there to have lunch. Well, you know, that's what money can afford you to do. Me, I want to have a good vegan meal. I'm going to sit there and go get me a manicure. I'm going to get me a pedicure. I'm going to go and get me a good massage. I've been working out in that gym. So I really need some love to these muscles that I'm, I'm working on building. So, so that's what we do. 
And so that's why you're doing what you do. I want you to see that this gives you opportunity to, to do some things that you want to do in life and, and to live those dreams. So I got to practice what I'm preaching. So I'm telling you right now, uh, these are the things that you can do. And some of you don't have those choices. That's the only thing with a job and with constraints like that contributes to you can't go on vacation when you want to. You know, you got to worry about answering to the boss if you decide to take a vacation. And more importantly, when it comes time to spend time with your kids, it takes a, uh, your kids have to take a back seat because you got to pay the bills. That's not living, ladies and gentlemen. You and I both know that. So that's why I want to keep you encouraged and keep you motivated to continue working towards your dream. Yeah, sure. Do the J-O-B, but always have that side hustle that allow you to fire your boss and hire your kids. So with that said, I'm going to go through this yellow light. I'm going to buy this. <laughs> I want to say to you, listen, spread the love by spreading the word as far as wealth is concerned. And I promise you, you'll be in abundance. Okay, I'm going to get out of here. Check out that nice little, that little trolley right there. We'll probably take a little trolley ride and get to learn about what happens in Miami and the history of Miami. Uh, we see a lot of these on Miami CI, uh, SCI, S CSI. They have Miami CSI out here. What other Miami shows do they have? I forgot. I forgot some of those Miami shows. Hey, everything's small out here on TV. Everything looks so big. So I'm seeing a lot of things I used to see on TV shows and having a good time. So with that said, ladies and gentlemen, I will see you the top, all the top. More importantly, the Kidpreneur that I'm a child, my mama will see you at the bank. Bye-bye for now. Ching, ching.